Introduce yourself, okay? Assess your patient. Once you identify the site where you're going to perform your blood draw, we're going to use the antecubital area. Apply your tourniquet three to four inches above the site of incision. Make sure the tourniquet's not too tight. Palpate for the vein. He has great venous structure, excellent median cubital, accessory basilic. He has a great cephalic vein as well. We're gonna go with the uh, median cubital vein. We performed a venipuncture there earlier, but we're going to go above the previous venipuncture site. When you're performing a venipuncture on the patient, you can utilize the same vein twice. You just cannot use the same entry point. So you can draw the blood above or below the previous site of incision, okay? Release the tourniquet. Clean the site with 70% alcohol. 20 seconds in concentric circles. Allow the site to dry. While the site is drying, you can assemble your butterfly needle. Continue the tubes closer to you. We're going to use the correct order of draw sequence. SST tube first for chemistry, then our lavender EVTA second. Okay? Reapply the tourniquet. Ask the patient to make a fist. Pick up the butterfly needle. Pinch the wings in between your index finger and thumb. Please make sure the bevel of the needle is facing upwards towards you. Indicators will be the gauge size of the wing on the right hand side, okay? Pinch and fold the wings, anchor so the vein doesn't roll, 5 to 10 degrees, go in, make an insertion, put on your vacutainer tube and allow the blood to flow, we won't take too much. Multiple draw, release the tourniquet. Twist and pull off the tube, place down your vacutainer holder, fold the gauze, retract the needle, ask the patient to apply pressure. Thank you, Rishu. If you want to purge the line, you can place your tube in, purge the excess blood, and then always remember to invert your tubes eight to 10 times. Two labeled and sent to the lab. We're going to take a look at the site, make sure everything is good. We can replace that bandage with a brand new one. Thank you, Shu. Apply your Coflex bandage. And then discharge your patient. 